Hi guys, and welcome back to another video. I am so excited to be back. Last week I posted something crazy, something funny, and this week I decided to do a what's in my bag. I think y'all enjoy this. I have like a lot of crazy stuff in my bag. It's like weird, random, and fun. So I think you guys will like this. Let's jump right in. All right, so I first want to talk about my bag. I have a Michael Kors bag and I bought this about I think three years ago. I don't care if it's out of the out of style or out of the season or whatever. Like I love this bag so much. I bought it with some friends at Macy's I want to say. It was on sale and I saw this and I was like, you know what? It's pink. It's cute. It has studs on it. I'm gonna buy it. Okay, so first off, I have a Nine West wallet. Next, I have my speaker because in my truck there isn't really an AUX, an aux cord, and I don't have Bluetooth. It's like an old car, it was my parents' car. So I struggle to find something to like plug it in and like help me with me, like listen to music. And I love music so much, so I carry my speaker around in my car. Hashtag DIY, you know, do it yourself. Next, I have my new pair of Ray-Bans. I bought these for my birthday. My birthday was a few weeks ago. And I decided to spoil myself and I bought these. Next, in my bag, I have a lit roller. Because, I mean, you know. You gotta be looking fresh everywhere you go. I also have a pack of gum by Peppermint Gum. It was like full, but I mean, I love gum. What can I say? Next, I have some untangled headphones. You just want to jam out to music. If I like, I like going to like Starbucks and reading there, like every now and then, and going to the gym. You know, just pull it out. There you go. Next, I like to carry lotion with me, and this is the Vaseline, Vaseline, Vaseline. I'm Mexican, I can't pronounce things right. Healthy hands, stronger nails. This is literally the best cream ever. I'm gonna put some on actually because of my skin. My hands feel so dry right now. Honestly, it doesn't make it like, like once it dries, it doesn't leave that like ugly cream feel, if you know what I mean. I'll put some on my elbows too, because I don't want it. A girl can't be ashy. Next, I have my keys. You know, girls gotta have her keys. Some keychains from Mexico, cause a girl loves Mexico. I also have some, <laughs> some Tums. You know, a girl just like, she eats a lot of like Mexican food and like, you know, Texas like barbecue like stuff and like girl gets gassy. So yeah, I have Tums and it's in the flavor smoothie. And you know what? Comes in handy. Cause I get heartburn sometimes, you know, eating those. I close that sword and like, you know, just like a bunch of like Mexican food. Oh well. Next I have a notepad. An empty notepad. I would say it's for my writing because I love to write a lot. I write poetry and stuff. But I use my phone for that. So I don't know what this notepad is doing here. One of these days, maybe I'll just pop it up and be like, you know what? <laughs> Receipts. I have scrunchies, hair ties. I mean, whenever I go to work, I sometimes forget hair ties. And I just, I'd rather keep them in my bag than leave them at home or in my truck because it's just, it's handy whenever I'm out and about and I need a hair tie. I don't have one around my wrist like I do now. And I'm like, oh my god, I need a hair tie. Or my friends need some, so. I got the whole thing in my purse. That's right. I'm the hair tie girl. <laughs> it's not like I have like stinky breath or something. I mean, I hope not. I brush my teeth every single day and mouthwash. I take real good care of my teeth and I floss. But Sometimes after eating and I don't want to chew gum, I just pop in an icebreaker. Next, I, in my bag, I have a Swiss army knife. Don't really ask me why I have a Swiss army knife, just accept that I have one. It really comes in handy 
and whenever I'm out and about, you know, people are like, oh, I need scissors. Got you. Oh, I need to open my wine. Got you. Honestly, a Swiss Army knife should be in every single girl's bag. I can't tell you guys how many times I've used a Swiss Army knife. It's not dangerous. It's used for, you know, daily necessaries. You never know when you need a Swiss Army knife. And I don't want to carry like a huge knife with me, even though it is Texas. No gracias. Speaking of protection, I think it's very, very important for us ladies to have protection and be aware that we live in a very unsafe world. So I carry around pepper spray with me and I have practiced how to use it and I think you should too. Go to your local academy and buy yourselves pepper spray. Keep pepper spray around with you guys. This one's full, thank goodness, but you never know. Some boy trying to be a little bit too close. Psst, psst. Bye. On a much lighter subject, I like to carry around Victoria's Secret Tees little perfume roller with me because sometimes oh, it smells so good. I walk out of the house, like, well, not walk because I never forget to put on perfume, but when I am running out of time and I'm running out the door, I'll be in my car, like, driving and I'll be like, oh my gosh, I forgot to put perfume. And I'm like, wait, I got a roller. I can just roll it on my wrist, roll it on my neck. And I smell so good, like a little tease. I mean, look at it. It's really good to have. Next, I have this lipstick. It's a matte lipstick. It's brown. And it's in the shade 650 Nude Embrace by Maybelline. I like it. So I'm quite a clumsy girl. I carry around Thai to go with me. And I've actually used it several times. Some of my friends have used it too. Let's just say <laughs> Tide can also be a girl's best friend. <laughs> Next, I like to carry Adva with me, um, you know, just for headaches, migraines, friends sometimes need it, period cramps, we've all been there. So, some a little, like a little bit of Advil, it's all good. I have a nail filer because, I mean, sometimes my nails, see th these are kind of short right now, believe it or not, these are short but whenever they're like longer and they suddenly break and <laughs> it's not fun when I have a broken nail and it's like stabbing everybody and I'm stabbing my my own fingers, my own like <laughs> self, like touching my hair, stab, you know, my cheek. I like how every time I say stab, I'm always like stab, stab, stab. I'm sorry. I also keep pens, you know, I guess it goes with the notebook to write and Sharpies because my job, I need to use Sharpies sometimes. So, here's pens and sharpies and stuff. Next, I have the NYX lingerie. The color Push Up. This is just a nice pink, pink lipstick. And also with the nail filer, I like to have nail clippers. They break and I need to just, oh my god, I almost cut my nail off. I'm gonna put these away before I actually cut my nail. I have Mexican candy, oh my god, this is Go Mango. Go Mango. Oh my god. This is a spicy one though, so I've been scared of like trying it because I don't like spicy stuff. Oh my god, and I have a little Versace. Versace. I probably said it wrong those two times. Perfume roller. I have like five of these because at Sephora, whenever they're like, do you want to redeem some points? And I'll see like the only thing good that I want at the time is that. And I love how it smells. And I'm like a little bit too poor to like afford a full perfume. I love it. And so like I carry it and they're like, oh my gosh, what are you wearing? And I'll be like, it's Versace. <laughs> so the next thing that I like to carry in my bag is a book. I always carry a book. And at the moment, I am reading two books at once. Um, yeah. So this one is actually um, Looking for Alaska by John Green. And I am almost halfway done. I like to keep myself busy. I actually read a lot. And right now, my favorite book is Looking for Alaska. Now, well, that's more like a fun 
read kind of thing. Let me show you guys what other book I'm reading at the moment. So my other book that I like to read is Blink. So I either have Blink or Looking for Alaska in my purse and I honestly I'm halfway through this book. Guys, if you want it like if you want more of an intellectual read that like honestly opens your mind up to the world and everything, I recommend Blink. I'm sorry you can't see it because of the glare. By Malcolm Gladwell. I recommend that book. And the last thing that I have in my purse is this little fan thing. And when you connect it to your phone, I'm using my mom's phone, I just put it in the little power thing and then It's a fan you can carry it in your I carry it in my purse and sometimes I use it like whenever because I live in Texas so I need this to survive in Texas with the weather <sighs> alright guys so that was what's in my bag and obviously I carry my phone in my bag sometimes hope you guys enjoyed this video I am so happy to be back and I just have a lot more things to do and I hope you guys subscribe. Click that bell somewhere down below to be alerted whenever I post a video because I will be posting videos randomly. Please make sure to like this video. Leave a comment down below and tell me what's your favorite item to carry in your purse. I think everybody carries, you know, just fun stuff that describe your personality and just like showing you guys what's in my bag. Now you know a little bit more about me and what I like to do and how I am as a person, really. All right, so thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys soon. Los quiero, bye.